So let's take another look at how the weave fits together. Once again, we're starting in split time circles, crossing one hand over and then the other. You might even find that it helps to have a rowing motion of your body, rocking back and forth to feel the rhythm of how the poi are chasing one another from side to side with your right hand and then left hand crossing continuously back and forth. Although ultimately you'd like, you, you'd want to learn how to keep your wrists close together, if it helps while you're learning, you can have them be bigger apart just to get the exaggerated feeling of your wrists taking turns crossing one over the other and one over the other. Another way to count out the weave is the number of beats that it takes for it to do a full cycle. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. This is called the five beat weave. 